Hey everybody, welcome to TZAD's Family Fitness. Today we're going to go over an upper body warm-up. Before we get started, a couple things I'd like to say. I am a registered kinesiologist, but this is by no means prescription exercise. If you are new to exercising or have any kind of chronic condition, whether it be heart, lungs, anything like that, please see your doctor before you begin exercise, whether it's mine or anyone else's, okay? Now, this is the warm-up, so you don't have to warm up before the warm-up. So what we're going to do is we're going to stay hydrated, we're going to go slow, we're going to pace ourselves, okay? They call it a warm-up, not a blast-off, okay? The way we always warm up is we always want to start with our big muscles and work down to our smaller muscles, okay? So you start with the big muscle groups in the shoulders and the chest and work down to little ones in your neck and your fingers and behind your back and stuff like that, okay? So to start off, I'd like to say that you can hold every stretch we do here for between 10 and 30 seconds. For the sake of time, I'm going to hold them for about 10 seconds, okay? A little bit more, a little bit less, depends on how much I'm talking, okay? So the first thing you want to do, okay, is you just want to march on the spot. Get those arms going. I know you think this looks kind of silly, looks kind of funny, but what we want to be doing is we want to get the blood moving, okay? We want to get the blood flowing. Okay, so just move your hands, move your feet, marching on the spot. Nothing crazy. You notice how this is zero impact. I'm not trying to jump. I'm just getting warm, okay? Getting going, getting going. Okay. So what we're going to do now is we're going to just calm, relax. Start with some shoulder rolls. Forwards or backwards, it's up to you. Nice big I don't knows. Now, this is the first thing you're doing early in the morning. You're probably going to get some Rice Krispies, some snacks, crackles, and pops. Totally okay. As long as there's no pain, keep on going. There's a big difference between pain and discomfort. Let's switch directions. Roll the other way. Get those traps moving. Get those shoulders moving. I love warm up. Okay. Next, what we're going to do, we're going to stick one arm up front. I'm going to start with my left. So, left arm is out in front of me. Right hand goes behind that left elbow. Okay? We're going to pull it across our chest towards our other shoulder. Go as far as you can comfortably. And just breathe. That's all we got to do. And we're going to relax that arm. We're going to switch sides. We have a second arm. We do it a second time. Right arm out in front. Left hand behind that right elbow. Pulling it in towards center. There we go. Just hold it. You can do whatever you want with your wrist out here, with your hand, it doesn't matter. You're not doing anything. Your shoulders where the action is at. And we can relax that. Next, what we're going to do is we're going to pretend like we have an inchy back back here, okay? We're going to lift our arm up overhead. We're going to try and reach down. We're trying to touch right back here in our spine, okay? We're reaching back as far as we can. We're going to gently give it some assistance with our other arm. We're not trying to pop it out of its socket. We're just trying to feel the stretch. You're going to feel it in your tricep muscle on the arm you're pushing. Okay, we're just holding. We're just breathing. Then we can let that go. We're going to switch sides. Once again, reaching up. We're still at you in that same spot. I don't know why, but we are. I'm going to push it down. Here with me, you're going to see a way better flexibility on my right side. Old injury. Still bothers me, ruins the flexibility, but you work with it. Well, you'll have your quirks, it's okay. We'll work through them. Okay, enough of the triceps. Let's get this chest warm. We're going to clasp our hands behind our backs, okay? Making a fist. Try and keep those palms together. What you're then going to do is you're going to push them down behind your bum. Just like that. Just holding. Just hold it. Okay. Let that out a little bit. Next, what we're going to do, we're going to clasp those hands back here, okay? Not the same. Can be either wrist really doesn't matter. We're just going to hold it, and what we're going to do is get our necks involved. So we're going to bring our left ear towards our left shoulder, okay? And we're just going to hold it here. Let it stretch out. Just relax those shoulders. Okay, let's switch sides. 
right ear or right shoulder. Now here, if you have vertigo, right, or tinnitus, okay, or a variety of other syndromes that cause you to get dizzy or unbalanced, do this against a wall or just avoid it altogether, okay? Do what makes you feel good. Okay, next what we're going to do is we're going to do some side bends. Just as the name implies, we're going to relax our hands over the side and we're going to push our fingertips down towards our side. We're going to feel the stretch. We're going to come back up. This is the one stretch where we're not holding it very long. We feel the stretch. We come back up. Just going down. Coming up. Going down. Coming up. Oh, it looks like my cat decided to join us for warm up today. What's going on, big guy? Yeah. Always let your pets work out with you. It's okay. They get used to it. One more time on each side here. Okay. Next, we're going to get these forearms warmed up, okay? We're going to grab our hand palm to palm, okay? We're going to straighten out that left arm, and we're going to push that palm backwards, pulling it towards our bellies. You're going to feel the stretch in your forearm. And we're going to switch arms. Go over to the other side. Stretch it out. Again, breathing, relaxing, getting warm. I can feel it. I know you can probably feel it too. Next, what we're going to do is you want to lock your fingers together, okay? Then you're going to flip your hands over. So if you had rings on, you'd see them. We're going to start below our hips. We're going to raise our arms up to about shoulder height. We're going to take a nice deep breath in. We're going to breathe out as we reach our arms up overhead, oh, as far as we can comfortably. We're just going to hold it up there. Oh. We're going to come right back down. Oh, stretching part is over. Now it's time for some functional moving stuff. So what we're going to do, we're going to start with L's, and we're going to touch them together, spread them apart. Touch them together. Spread them apart. Here we go. Getting ready for chest flies, right? We're doing that. There we go. Okay, next what we're going to do is just some arm raises. Raise them up. Raise them down. Keep your knees bent here. Feet are flat. Just getting moving. Good for shoulder raises, right? That's what these guys are for. Come to the center, out to the side. Side raises, right? We're doing side raises. This is just functional stuff, okay? Without the weight, getting your muscles used to doing it. There we go. There we go. Oh. Okay. Next, we're going to hold our arms up front and we're going to pretend like we're flying backwards, pushing the backs of our hands to the back of the room. Notice how my knees are bent. I'm leaning a little bit forward. Oh, get them moving. I'm getting warm now. If you're staying with me, you're feeling it too. There we go. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. Last one we're going to do, okay? Just some gentle jogging on the spot. Get those arms moving. Adding in a little bit of impact now, okay? Getting them moving. Get those hands working. Get the blood flowing. We're ready to go. We're ready to go. Let everything be loose. Let everything be loose. Okay? I don't care how you look. I don't care how I look. Just get loose. Let that body just relax. There we go. Okay. Okay. <sighs> you need some water? Grab some water. Guess what? You're ready for today's workout. Whatever that is. Okay? As long as you the upper body. If you're doing legs or something today, go check out my lower body warm up. Okay? It's there. Click it. Watch it. Get into it. Thank you for watching. Enjoy your workout.